this mask are the perfect skincare treatment to help you with your skincare concerns. The right face mask can help hydrate skin, remove excess oils, and help improve the appearance of your pores. They are also an excellent way to help flush out impurities from the skin. Welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video. Are you noticing wrinkles on your skin? Do you find your skin starting to sag? Guess what guys, if this is happening, it means that you are losing the collagen production. You're losing the elasticity in the skin. Now what can you do about it? You can actually use natural homemade remedies to help to control all of that, to help to boost the collagen production, to have your skin looking younger, wrinkle-free and basically radiant and glowing. Today I'm going to share a very simple recipe with you. I'm using ingredient that is loaded with vitamin C. I'm using ingredient that is going to moisturize that skin. I'm using ingredient that's going to plump the skin up, that's going to firm the skin, that's going to give you a fresh, bright looking skin. And these ingredients are readily available to most people. So look around in your kitchen for these ingredients ingredients with this facial mask up and you're on your way to wrinkle free beautiful younger fresher looking skin so if you're interested in today's video continue watching our first ingredient is pomegranate and pomegranate is now a very popular fruit to use on the skin since it has anti-aging properties pomegranate will help to get rid of wrinkles from the aging skin pomegranate will also help to shrink those pores it is also a great ingredient to boost the collagen production in the skin plumping up the skin shrinking the pores and basically leaving your skin much much younger, much softer and supple. Our second ingredient is the banana and this is another wonderful fruit to use on the skin. Banana will moisturize the skin while getting rid of dark spots and blemishes on the skin. Banana will also help to plump the skin up, leaving your skin soft, supple, radiant. And if you're looking for glowing skin, if you're looking for bright, healthy looking skin, the banana is going to work wonders for you. So now I'm going to put these two together to create an awesome facial mask. Now here I have the pomegranate seeds and what I'm going to do, I'm going to crush the pomegranate seed to get to the pomegranate juice. So after crushing the seeds and straining, here we have the pomegranate juice. So next I'm moving on to the banana and I'm using only a half of a medium banana. <coughs> I'm just going to peel the banana. Next, I'm just going to chop the banana since I'm going to be blending. So just chop a half of a medium banana. Now place this in the blender. Now guys, I have an optional ingredient which is lemon. So I'm just going to squeeze about a, a teaspoon of lemon juice in. And lemon is a wonderful brightening agent. It is great for clearing the skin. It has antibacterial properties, which is great for the skin. Now, after squeezing the teaspoon of lemon juice in, I'm now going to pour a tablespoon of the pomegranate juice in the blender along with the banana. And now I'm going to blend. And here it is. This is it. This is our banana pomegranate facial mask. This wonderful facial mask, as I mentioned before, is going to lighten and brighten the skin. It's going to clear the skin from spots and blemishes. It's also going to leave the skin just soft, supple, and radiant. So now I'm going to show you how to apply and use your wonderful banana pomegranate facial mask for best result. 
Now, when it comes on to taking care of your skin, especially when applying a facial mask, you want to make sure to start with clean skin. So wash your face, exfoliate your skin, and then you are ready for your facial mask. Now, this facial mask, I'm going to use a brush to apply to clean skin. So you want to make sure to just give it a little stir. Now this amount I made is just for one use. However, if you want to make more of this mask, double up on the ingredient, make enough to last you for seven days in your refrigerator. Okay, so once you start, you're gonna apply the facial mask to your skin. And I like to apply this facial mask in upward stroke. I also like to put this facial mask in the refrigerator before I apply it to the skin. And in that way, I get a mask that is gonna further help to plump the skin up in case you don't know if you apply ice on your skin it's gonna give you an instant plump to the skin so if you have to go out and you want a quick treat to your skin just rub some ice on it so therefore whenever you are applying facial mask not all facial masks but this one is good for that purpose just put it in your refrigerator just before you use it leave it there for about half an hour let it cool and then you apply it to your skin you get a double dose right here you get an anti-aging facial mask that is gonna do all the wonderful things to your skin but the coolness from the facial mask is also gonna further help to plump the skin up so now that I apply the facial mask to my skin take a look at it and as you can see my cheek right here I should have applied this to just one side of my face because this mask is so cold on my skin it is basically instantly plumping my skin up now after you apply this mask you want to sit with it for at least 30 minutes as I'm gonna do now so I'm gonna sit with mine for 30 minutes then I'm gonna rinse off and I'm gonna come back and show you the result now after applying your facial mask you want to sit with it for 30 minutes after 30 minutes you just rinse this off with some some room temperature water pack dry the skin and apply your favorite facial toner or your favorite facial serum or your favorite facial moisturizer or just use all three okay so I'm just gonna chill with this a little guys and then I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna show you my result and I'm back and take a look at my skin after rinsing the facial mask off So there you have it. Thank you all for watching. Guess what, guys? This is a must try. I actually really and truly love this facial mask. Now, if you cannot get the pomegranate, I do understand because it is seasonal. However, if you can get your hands on it, give it a try. This is actually an amazing facial mask. Now, if this was the first time watching, guys, don't leave without subscribing. Look below, you're gonna see the word subscribe. Click on it and you will be subscribed. Also guys, if you click on my face below the video, it will take you to my channel page and there you will find a wide variety of video. Click on playlists or click on videos and just scroll. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.